Hey, thanks so much for interacting with our sermons. Again, um, submitting questions through our website and tracking along with our Nehemiah series. This has been a lot of fun. Uh, it, the question this week is, of course, a really good one. Uh, I was asking, in terms of finding a place to serve, do I, do I only serve in maybe my area of giftedness? Or do I serve outside of my area of giftedness um, if I see a need somewhere else? We talked about in Nehemiah chapter 3, everyone on Nehemiah's team was all in building the wall. Uh, whether they were actually wall builders or not, everybody was helping out with the effort to rebuild the wall. So this person wanted to know, should I just jump in where I see a need or should I only serve in my area of giftedness. And I would say in scripture, I think, I think we see two different situations. One situation uh, is maybe what we call urgent and the other situation is maybe what we call ideal. And of course, we always want to be shooting for ideal. We always want to work ourselves into an ideal situation, but sometimes we have to deal with an urgent situation. And if it's an urgent situation, then just jump in and serve where there is the need, right? This is Nehemiah's uh, circumstance in Nehemiah chapter 3. They have to get this wall up quick. The opposition is on the way. People are going to try to tear down their efforts, so they need everybody all in immediately. You know, if the, if the boat is sinking, um, you just start pailing water out of the side. You don't have to ask, hey, is that really my gift? Um, it doesn't matter if it's your gift. If you don't do it, um, the whole ship is going to sink, right? So uh, if there's something super urgent, go ahead, jump in, and do it. But that's not ideal. That's not where we want to be. Where we want to be is everyone involved uh, only in their area of giftedness. And if everybody is involved, um, you know, God promises us, 1 Corinthians 12, that he has given every believer a gift. And so if every believer really is using their gift uh, in, the, in the proper setting in the local church, then every need will be fulfilled and everybody will be contributing to the mission. So that is the ideal which we always want to shoot for. Um, in 1 Corinthians 12 where it says, you know, that there's different parts of the body, an eye, an ear, a nose, a foot. Um, if an ear is doing the job of a nose, Maybe it can make something happen, uh, but that's certainly not ideal. So that's not what we want to shoot for, although sometimes it has to happen. Um, so the question then is, what are we at Bridges? Are we in an urgent situation or are we in an ideal situation, especially when we come to gather again? And I would say... Uh, we have kind of a mixture of both. We do have urgent needs. Uh, we need, or we will, we, we, we did when we were gathering before. We have urgent needs right now. We need more people uh, calling and connecting with others. Um, on our service page that we put up before, connectbcc.org slash serve, we want you to fill out where you can serve, um, like right now. And a number of those needs really are urgent. So in some ways, we are an urgent situation. On the other hand, we have a lot of, we have really a lot of people who, who aren't serving somewhere. Um, and so we want... We want everybody in on service. We don't want this to be for a select few. We want everybody to feel like they are really adding to uh, everything that we're doing around here. And so the, the, where, where we should probably position ourselves right now um, is if you see a need and it's not your area of giftedness, what would be best is probably to show that area of need to somebody else that you know who it is their area of giftedness. Say, hey, this is an urgent need. I happen to know it lines up with your area of giftedness. Let's bring those together. Um, and so that could be an awesome role that you would be fulfilling right now. Uh, that would be a contribution that you would be giving to this mission is connecting uh, areas of need that you see uh, to the people who can best fulfill those needs because it's the gifts that God has enabled them. Um, that's what we want to shoot for, right? We always want, uh, we always want ideal.
Uh, we, we never want to have to settle for urgent. Well, hey, thanks again for submitting your questions, and we look forward uh, to interacting some more in the week ahead.